May 2013, Mark Cuban took to his personal blog to announce an NBA first. Fans would have the chance to design and submit new uniforms for the team. The only guidelines were staying true to the logo and staying close to the current color schemes while allowing flexibility in terms of incorporating past colors. The opportunity lasted until the end of the month, and Cuban received over 1,000 entries through his blog, Mavs.com, and CrowdSpring. Four months later in September, Cuban selected 10 finalists from the entries to be voted upon by fans on the team's website for about a month. The selected finalists' uniforms employed a variety of different looks, ranging from imitations of other teams' uniforms, a heavy emphasis on horizontal stripes, a return to green, and the Dallas skyline. Although they did not play that Christmas, during the 2013-2014 season, Adidas produced a special sleeve jersey for the team. This jersey had a white base with a simplified horse logo on the chest in silver and blue, in OB in black, midnight blue numbers with silver trim on the back and left sleeve, and a midnight blue v-neck collar. Next season, the Mavericks traded for Rajon Rondo, and the NBA decided to copy his diva behavior and move their logo from the front of the jerseys to the back collar. So the Mavs simply moved the star from there to the buckle of the shorts and entirely removed it from the alternate. Again not playing December 25th, Adidas made designs for a Mavericks Christmas jersey. These were essentially the same as the regular home whites, but substituted the word mark for the simplified horse logo, had royal blue numbers with silver trim in the center, the same on the back, removed the Mav star, and had a blue nameplate for the player's first name rather than the last. Dallas would play in their slightly different main set for three seasons, going 125 and 121 in that time. Past Mavs who wore these include J.J. Barea, Tyson Chandler, Monte Ellis, Devin Harris, Dwight Powell, Chandler Parsons, Wesley Matthews, Darren Williams, Harrison Barnes, and Dirk Nowitzki. A mock-up of the winning fan-created uniforms, initially slated to be revealed October 28, 2013, before the start of the next season, was eventually shown during a media event in September 2014. The jersey had been designed by Dallas native Jeff Case. His initial design had three versions, a home, an away, and an alternate jersey all featuring the Dallas skyline. With the home in white and the road and alternate in midnight blue, the Dallas script sat beneath on a royal blue band in white on the home and away versions, with the numbers in blue with silver trim to the right and the skyline in silver. The collar featured metallic silver and a royal blue striping with a blue inverted triangle at the point with a silver star. The sides had a blue stripe with a silver stripe going down the middle. These extended to the shorts with a diamond on the right leg with the simplified Mavs horse logo in white in it. On the back of the jersey, the numbers were the same with the name and horse logo in blue on the home and the name and logo in white on the away and alt. The alternate replaced the striping on the collar and sides and the skyline with green, the band with midnight blue, the numbers in white and green trim, and the diamond on the shorts now all green with a black logo. During the unveiling, the physical jersey shown was slightly different from the original concept. The base went from navy to midnight blue, the inverted triangle with star was replaced with a silver Mav star usually found on the back above the NOB, the Dallas script was now black with silver trim, the numbers were now silver with white trim and moved to the center, and most noticeably, 
the Reunion Tower was missing from the skyline. Cuban confirmed on Twitter afterwards that the iconic 50-story tower would be on the official jerseys. <laughs>